I'm selling all my possessions, that's why I'm making this video. I'm moving to California to finish writing my book and to also uh, get a movie made, uh, get it optioned or whatever for a movie. And uh, so I'm selling all of uh, my possessions. And so this is not a yard sale. This is not a, um, I'm not selling my junk to offload it for a few bucks or, you know, 50 cents. Um, so we have some really nice items here. We have items of intrigue uh, and items of interest. And I'm going to run through this pretty slow so everybody can get a good look. And if you haven't seen the first part of the video, that just gives us a quick overview. Uh, the place was a little bit better staged, I, I think. And um, so, uh, let, me, let me begin by this. Um, or with this, actually. If you like anything you see here, please give me a call. Uh, it's going to be hard to work with text messages because I think this is a Google number and I don't know how that works. I didn't really look into it too much. So um, if you want anything here, I'm doing, I can do curbside. Uh, if it's something light, I could bring to the curb. Uh, but I really suggest you come up and see it. Um, I'm wearing a mask. I've been maintained my health throughout this whole thing. And um, everyone here has been all right. My, my neighborhood hasn't really been affected at all. Uh, not to my knowledge anyway, which is good. And um, so I'm going to book appointments. They're going to be about 15, 20 minutes long with a, with a 10 minute cushion. So um, if your tour goes a little bit longer, it's okay. Uh, so I'm, gonna, I'm not going to have more than one or two people in here. And also, um, with everything winding down, I think, or starting to wind down, uh, it's, a, it's a good time. Uh, so, come on over <laughs> and check out what I got. So here, I'm going to start with the first item. This is a futon. Um, it, uh, I have dimensions, which I'll, I'll show you later, and I'll actually, at the end of the video, I'll show how it works. So, um, with the light, it's just a little bit... Um, but anyway, so these are the pillows. You can have it with or without the pillows. It's $100. It's uh, beige micro suede. And uh, <laughs> it's, it's quite stylish, actually. This came from a Florida house, uh, so it wasn't really used much. It, the house was empty for most of the year. Uh, and there'll be a few other items that, that came from that Florida house. So um, uh, we do have a little bit of wax from like, one of my friends. You can hardly see it. Uh, it's, it's pretty faint. And we have some slight burns also from a candle, uh, very minimal. So that's why I'm doing 100 bucks on this. Uh, but it is, uh, other than that, I, I just steam cleaned it um, with natural solvent, uh, not solvent, but natural cleanser, uh, fruit based. And um, it's looking good and smelling good too. We, next item, we have 55 gallon fish tank. I only have about five guppies in there, and uh, I am giving those away to a good home. So free guppies to a good home, come and adopt them. There are about five, five or six left. Um, the tank will be available, uh, I'm moving out of here no later than May 31st, so um, the tank will be out of here by then. I have to wait to see if there's any more babies that are lingering around, because they tend to hide from adults uh, for a while until they get bigger. Um, that's not for sale. I painted that. And uh, this lamp is for sale. Um, it's 23, probably 20 bucks on that. But uh, it's um, all these lights are operational. And uh, it's a pretty interesting lamp because you can direct light anywhere uh, along your wall. Um, first item of intrigue is Admiral, a portrait of. Admiral Bradley A. Fisk, who was a United States Admiral. Let me shut off this light. And this also came from the Florida House. This is uh, this is 200, and I will again. I will help you bring these items. If you know, if you're one person showing up, I can help you bring these items in to your vehicle. Um, so I'm not allowing more than one or two people, so couples are fine. Please don't bring any children or pets. Um, this is a very 
clean apartment actually. I've maintained it quite well. And uh, so it's fairly, it's dust free, it's uh, allergen free, I have no pets, there's been no smoking here. So um, I've been here four years and everything's pretty clean. And uh, so if you want an item, it'll, it'll come to you clean. <laughs> okay, so that is the Admiral Bradley Fisk and his dimensions are, if you're, in case you're wondering, 42 by 65. So it's a pretty big, big portrait, and let's get a better look at it from here. We have a little bit of glare from the light. I got a lot, all the lights on as well, so so you could see everything well. So that's oh oh, and uh, so that's 200. There are there is some damage, but it can be fixed. Uh, let me not go so fast. Um, it could be touched up. Somebody already tried, and here his hands a little bit mushad, as the Italians say. So, um, he was, um, inventor as well, he, by his, at his death, he held over a hundred U.S. patents, um, very crafty type individual, and, uh, also, the light loves to follow him for some reason, but anyway, enough of that, we have, this is an, another item of intrigue, this is, um, this is a mirror, so you can check your look before you go out, there's me. And um, it's also a candle holder, so it's got kind of a dungeon-y feel. So it would be good if you do have a dungeon, you can probably, uh, you know, accessorize well or whatever. And uh, let me get back a little bit. So it's got the candle holder for this type of candle. And um, I bought this, it was kind of an impulse buy, I loved it. And uh, I just, I, I have a sports car now, so <laughs> uh, I'm not taking much at all. And um, here is a candle holder, which uh, accents this area nicely. And then uh, for display, I just threw on this um, letter holder, his and hers, I guess, because there's two. Uh, they have some ships on it, and uh, it's kind of a brass plated finish. And I think this one's actually brass, maybe. Um, this wall tapestry I wasn't really gonna sell it but you know what I'll throw 60 bucks on it if anybody wants it um, it's just less stuff I have to take with me and uh, it's uh, the tree of life I believe I bought this in um, what the hell was it uh, it art art and music festival there was a vendor there there were a lot of these unique styles um, I'd imagine you probably wouldn't find it anywhere so it's pretty big and uh, next item this desk is free this wooden desk actually not the black item sitting on top of it so this wooden desk I've had for quite a while came out of Montclair New Jersey and uh, it's a nice redwood kind of Scandinavian I guess style so it is it is free and it's free because this smoky glass uh, top here I cracked it recently because I dropped something on it and uh, it's it's hidden actually and also there's a, a, a fastener here that uh, pops out a little bit and that could be glued in actually I, I just never did it um, so other than that it's a fine desk and you can pick up one of these glass tops you know cut to your specifications at any glass shop uh, whether you want smoky or not or whatever uh, probably for like, you know, not a lot, maybe, I don't know, 30 bucks or something, 35, 40 bucks. Um, anyway, so that's the desk, and uh, it has three drawers. And if you want to throw a lock in it, there's a hole you can, you can uh, set up a lock in there. And uh, what else? So this item is a riser. So what this black... Uh, contraption allows me to do is I can I'll show it to you by actually I'll raise it and then I'll put the camera on it so you can see and it turns your workspace into a standing desk so you can just stand here and work from home um, great if you have bouts of sciatica um, I bought this on eBay, it was delivered, I could show it to you in my order history. I bought it September for 170 bucks, I believe, or 160 something bucks. So it's 100, and uh, it's pretty cool. 
because uh, you don't have to sit in pain sometimes <laughs> when you have to work those long hours. So I love this contraption. And uh, it's a lot healthier than sitting all day. And uh, maybe you don't care, but that's, that's okay. I'm not selling that. That's going with me. Because uh, it's one of my philosophies anyway. I care, but I don't care too much because, uh, I don't know, life is good. Oh, well, these blinds are awesome. I will get to them a little bit later. Um, ma uh, what is it? Matchstick bamboo. Uh, it doesn't collect dust, which is kind of interesting. I, I didn't know if that's one of its characteristics. But um, got a little glass star if you want it. And uh, here is this uh, lovely candle holder for, what do we got that for? Let me zoom in. Six bucks. Really lovely. Six, six whole dollars. Okay? And if you want to gift wrap it, look, I even have these little things here. Bows. Um, this table, this table set or whatever, whatever it's called. Um, redwood, natural, not, it's, it's, whatever, painted, shellac, whatever they call it. Um, but, uh, it, uh, you know, it's got, like, a little bit of, uh, blemish on it, on the top. I mean, not a lot, but, uh, I'm blowing it out because, um, it, yeah, it's got some wear on it, but overall, it, it looks pretty good, as you can see. But, you know, it's got a little wear. Um, nothing crazy, but I'm going to blow this out for $40 with the chairs, okay? And if you're concerned about, you know, uh, there's some little blemishes from, you know, whatever. Nothing major here. Um, I have a lovely, a lovely tablecloth um, someone actually gave me, I believe. No, 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 I actually bought this one in, uh, I don't know where. Um, but uh, it's 10 bucks. And it's really pretty. Look at this. So, and it fits this. It's a little bit bigger than the than than what would be you know prescribed for this table, but uh, it's really nice. And the table dimensions are, and the uh, chair cushions are um, also beige micro suede. So this wasn't by design. It just kind of fell into my lap. The chairs are a little bit lighter, but you can see you got a match here pretty much. Let me go get it from this angle. Uh, Fair, the chairs are lighter, but you got a pretty good match here, and uh, you know if you want the set, we can we can work that. Uh, I bought this for over twice what it's worth. It's one of these uh, I don't know new age bracelet thingies, and uh, I don't know. I'm just not a jewelry guy, so after a while, I like it a lot, but after a while, I didn't want it anymore. Just because I don't know. I don't like to be encumbered by stuff on my body um, so that's it check it out it's some kind of like volcanic stone uh, the person I bought it from this she, she buys it wholesale from designer somewhere maybe Manhattan or Europe she's from Europe and uh, it's supposed to be uh, charged with some kind of energy which uh, felt pretty good while I had it on so um, it's probably something to it there anyway um, uh, this plant's free because it adapted itself to sitting on the fridge and it doesn't look pretty right now, but I'm training it because I'll be putting it back on the window. So next item, here's an item of, uh, what do we call it? Intrigue. This lamp, It's uh, I was told it's one of a kind from the person. Oh, by the way, so some of these items, my ex-wife, she used to... Um, she used to troll a lot of the, um, what are they called? Uh, this came from family, but she used to troll the, um, some yard sales once in a while and uh, some auctions, actually, where uh, a lot of dealers used to go to. So this was an item, I think she outbid some dealers for it. But um, this is a gorgeous lamp. There is a story behind it. It was a, a prop for a movie, and they, it might be custom made. It might be unique. Um, I don't know much beyond that. And uh, this one's really, really stylish. 150 
give you that jazz parlor feel or um, if you have a pool room somewhere where you play billiards not swimming uh, you can definitely um, add more panache and you know jazz let's say and uh, this mirror here is uh, also came from an auction this one and uh, it's got a lovely shape this was in our restaurant so this is a pad thai restaurant heirloom and uh, it's 97 bucks um, gorgeous item gorgeous item so um, here next item of intrigue no no let's let's keep going here I have a portable dishwasher it's a full size this thing saved my life I'm telling you because I started cooking a lot and uh, this is this was over six hundred dollars new I bought it from Sears I have the manual I have the receipt uh, August will be three years um, it's just it saved my life it's full size and um, I definitely I rinsed everything before I put it in here very thoroughly and um, I don't do cutting boards in here that's just getting stuff out of the way but it's full size I think it's two feet wide which is 24 inches and um, I rinsed everything thoroughly and uh, soak everything so before I put it in um, it's fairly clean I don't know it's like a European thing um, so this cow uh, portrait is 15 bucks and it's a gorgeous one really really nice something there's very something very surreal about it so you can have that for 15 I'll bring that to the curb here's a nice little hamburger plaque um, five bucks stop in and catch up with the best so you can do that stop on in um, I am selling some of this cookware um, there's more around in cabinets and uh, this is an item of uh, interest it's a punch bowl with eight cups I believe it's some kind of crystal uh, there's no markings on it so I don't know who made it but um, there's these little dainty little eight of these suckers and I'll put in a dishwasher maybe tonight if nobody buys it today because I'll, I'll get it sparkly it's been sitting in a closet and it's 50 bucks and it comes with eight cups eight cups and it's 50 bucks and uh, you can't really get a good look at it over there but let me just get some contrast here uh, it's a nice it's a nice piece it's a really nice piece so again I have I have good items here uh, I'll be going through the closets there'll, there'll be some smaller items there like lower dollar items and I'll be pulling those out and uh, also putting prices on everything so everything here is much to sell and if if if, if it doesn't have a price um, make an offer. I mean, I, I think most things in life have a price, so make an offer. Um, we, oh, <laughs> this is a great item. I love this. So it really just kind of jazzed up the place a little bit. This is, um, you know, for your man cave or your, if you have a bar, if you have a finished basement where you entertain your friends, uh, perfect. Just beautiful. Um, $37. And uh, just got a nice, got a nice look and feel and vibe to it. What else do we have? So let me get a drink of water. Uh, this bookshelf, basic bookshelf, uh, solid wood also, not press wood. Um, Fifty bucks. Fifty bucks. It's got some um, paint that came off on it while I moved it. I guess a couple times, or maybe the. Other. And this back we can. I'm going to affix before you take it with uh, industrial staple gun. Um, it had staples in there, but they came a little bit loose. That's not a big deal. I got the new pegs. So, mm. and guess what else I'm selling? Oh, this sucker too. I guess the price fell off. Uh, maybe he doesn't want to get sold. I don't know. But, uh, uh, give me 20 bucks. And you can have it. It's a nice ship. Okay. There it is. It's uh, sheet metal. That's a gold color. And uh, 
I put some money in there. Some treasures, so that's mine. I'll be taking that out. And uh, there's another look. So here we have DVDs, one for three, two for five, five for ten, and six DVDs for twelve dollars. And uh, Planet of the Apes is mine, keeping it. But um, I got a lot of great titles here, and most of them are for sale. So come by and check them out. Nip Tucks for sale. Complete first season, 10 bucks. Where'd it go? 10 bucks. Okay, most of these books are for sale as well. And uh, great, some great titles for young uh, developing minds, let's say. So uh, come on by and check it out. What do we got? Prices on the books. Most books, oh, there's more books. Most books are one to three dollars each. I'm blowing them out. So we got we got some really good titles here, folks. Um, especially if you're into business and entrepreneurial ship. Um, what else? CDs. Eh, not a lot, but we got some titles. CDs, 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 CDs. Uh, what are we doing on the CDs? One for two bucks, two for three, five for four, six for five. This is the curio cabinet that's for sale. This is a item of intrigue. Um, really beautiful piece. Uh, my ex-wife bought it from a family whose parents, I think, um, whose parents, yes, parents bought it. So it's at least probably 50 years old. Um, so we're looking for 600 for that, and uh, it's it's got a nice the the wood's got a nice sheen to it, you know, even after all these years. So um, it's got a nice design in the front. I've seen one. A friend of mine in uh, River D Riverdale, New York, which is the northern end of the Bronx, he has one. It doesn't have this nice little trim here, which um, I don't know. But anyway. It's really it, it, great for just, you know, tricks and trinkets and, and all kinds of, you know, cool knickknacks and, uh, you know, old French postcards or whatever. And we have, uh, you know, so it's, it holds a lot, actually. <laughs> um, and it's quite an enchanting piece. I mean, just take a look at it, all right? So if you have an altar... Right with you, you and your wife, or girlfriend, or yourself. Um, this will really just kind of bring it all together, and uh, it's it's nice. It's really, I love this piece. Sorry, I have to sell it. Actually, I'm, I am sorry I have to sell it. Uh, but anyway, here it is, and uh, lighting's kind of crazy. I have it. Let me see. Let me see if I can adjust this a little bit better so you can get a better look at it. Ah, a little bit better. So here, let me just do a little close up, close up action so you can see. And uh, it is a very lovely piece. And here are the dimensions on that. And I'll get back to the futon dimensions towards the end. So Curio or China cabinet, 44 in 5 8 inches wide, right? So that's a cross wide and then 56 and a half inches high from floor to, to top and then 15 inches deep, right? From the face, the front to the wall and we're looking for 600 for that and uh, you'll be very happy with this uh, and I can help you bring it downstairs and load it up. I'd bring some moving blankets for sure and uh, maybe a strong friend if you're a lady buying this and we'll get this out into your car or van or moving truck what have you so moving right along I have actually two of these lovely units this is a uh, a Daewoo air conditioner let's look at the specs here 5300 yes 5300 BTUs and uh, let me zoom in a little bit so here are the specs 
And I have two of these babies, and these sell for, I don't know, I think like 180, maybe 160, 170, depending. If, even if, I don't know if Dave was even making them. And uh, here's, here's the specs again. So besides picking these items up, I did also determine another way that you can obtain some of these items. Um, UPS, well actually I, I did verify this with FedEx, but I'm sure the same holds true for UPS. Um, if you have a FedEx or if you obtain a FedEx or a UPS account number, um, I can use your account number to bring the item to a, let's say, FedEx pack and ship location and they will pack it uh, and ship it at your expense using your FedEx account number. Um, all you have to do first is pay me for the item through PayPal or Venmo and um, then you, I can ship that item to you. I am not packing and shipping anything uh, myself because I just do not have the time for it. I will be vacating this apartment no later than May 31st which is about 15 days from uh, the creation of this film and uh, so if you want any of these items um, again you can obtain them um, by uh, providing your FedEx or UPS account number I will in turn bring it to a local FedEx UPS store and they will charge accordingly for their services to pack and ship the items over to you so there's another option and here we have a 17 by 20 inch uh, it is watercolor on paper frame is lovely simply gorgeous look at this frame this probably cost a hundred dollars at least minimum uh, back when it was done probably over 20 years ago and now this frames worth double I'm, I'm selling this for thirty dollars everything must go folks beautiful 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 painting thirty bucks come and get it drive up front I'll come down and hand me the cash um, this is some kind of a I don't know guy who lives out in the prairie and this is his desk he's got the oil lamp little box and a book. So uh, that's that and on this side we have something I painted back in 01. Uh, I think I named this hurricane or something. That's what it looks like. And uh, this is oil on wood and it's five bucks. Come and get it. Look at that. Gorgeous. Beautify any part of your home with this. This typhoon. And next we have some <clears throat> some art actually we have this was given to me this is uh this is just a I guess a printed image on foam and uh, appears to be I don't know poster board on on some thin foam so it's not that thick uh, maybe five eighths of an inch there it is and uh, I was told that uh, this is this was early uh, this is early sexy from from Paris from France. Um, this was a lady they put on some postcards, I believe, and uh, some considered like very early like softcore, uh, even from France back then. So um, kind of an interesting piece. I I never had it up. I, I didn't have the wall space, but I thought maybe she could come with me where I'm going next. But you can have this lovely lady for five bucks, and she already comes gift wrapped. Look at that. So if you need a birthday gift, um, come on down. Oh, we have matchstick bamboo shades. I have six of them. These are lovely. Uh, 30, they're, they're 36 inches wide, okay, across, by 70 inches long, up and down. Now, if your windows are shorter, mine are a little shorter, but if your windows are shorter, uh, I have six of them for a hundred bucks total, okay? 30, again, 37 inches by 70 inches, uh, let me show you what they look like. Uh, it goes up with two of these little posts here it's very simple just bang them in actually you screw these in and you can just do a starter hole with a drill bit or whatever and uh, this is how they look 
when they're down. Very lovely. They don't block out all the light, so that's not really what you want it for. They're, they're more stylish, okay? And, um, you know, they let, they let some of the light in, but nobody can see you. So if you want to put these up and run around naked, you can because they'll only see um, a blur, I guess. I don't know. We'll have to test it out one day, maybe. If you want to run around naked, I'll look out, look in the window from outside. Um, so this is what they look like. And again, you don't have to have a window that's 70 inches uh, long to take advantage of these because, you know, just whatever excess you have on the bottom will sit there curled up on the sill. So it's not a big deal at all. And uh, these are, I have six of these. They're all the same size, uh, size I mentioned earlier. And, uh, oh, the, the very nice thing, I, now these came from, uh, I don't know, a friend a while back when she moved to Arizona, I believe it was. Um, <clears throat> they, uh, they don't collect any dust, really. I got them, when I got them in, they were dust-free. Well, these have been sitting. They totally dust-free. Um, and I've maintained them that way, and uh, again, I mean, I've maintained a clean home, but these, I don't know if that's like an inherent characteristic of, of matchstick bamboo, but, uh, it does not collect dust, or dust, it is, dust is repelled by it. I, I'm not sure. You might want to look that up on Wikipedia. Um, oh, and I just actually pulled this out of the closet. Um, this... This is a wooden box. This this came from an auction house. I, I uh, there were actually two of these. I think we sold one. My ex-wife grabbed this one. Now this is an oil painting. Maybe I should. Here we go. Okay. There's too much glare there. So this is an oil painting on on a decorative wooden box, and you can actually use a you can use a a lock here because there's a there's a couple there's a piece of hardware here that, that'll allow you to use a lock and uh, I just pulled it out so I'm gonna vacuum it out a little bit but um, you know it's got a little bit of wear not much some some nicks some some small dings like on the corners but uh, I mean it just kind of adds to it to its charm I think and uh, very lovely box and I could do this one for 60 so if you want this um, you know Great for sitting in a corner, maybe with some of your favorite magazines. They don't have to be uh, out in the open. You can keep them there, or yarn, or whatever you're, you know, into. Um, I don't know, uh, firearms. <laughs> but uh, lovely box. So sixty bucks on that. And um, oh, I just found out. I have to. Uh, I have to mention, but I'll mention that later. This heat, oh, and the table below here. This is, uh, this is five bucks. I'm blowing this out. I just use this as like a utility or an ancillary table. And, um, yeah, it's got a little wear on it, but it's a, it's a solid wood. It's got a good look. Um, it's five bucks. Just come grab it. <clears throat> five bucks. It's yours. Um, if I kept it in the corner. When I needed it, I just pull it out and put it back. So, um... This heater, let me sit, this heater, uh, we, when we had a big house, we had a lot of these, uh, well, not a lot, but a few. We had about four of these, I think, because um, we'd put them in strategic locations in the house so we wouldn't have to use, uh, whatever, too much uh, gas heating oil. And uh, this particular one, um, I like the best because it's very durable and uh, it, it, the face plate cracked or came off or whatever, but you really don't need it. Um, I could set a mark where the zero is for the dial, but uh, works really well. Um, this one, you know, they, they all sat for a while after we sold the house and this one fired up right away after, after a while and had no smell and uh, it just works great. I actually used it this w past winter because... Um, the boiler wasn't working uh, for like most of the day until they repaired it uh, on, on one or two occasions. And, and I got to use this in my apartment to keep myself uh, warm. So, um, you know, if you got a workout room or maybe you're using the, the, um, your basement for that or garage and it's cold. And, uh, you know, you turn this on 20 minutes ahead of time, boom, the, the room's warm. 
And uh, very durable, reliable, like this unit, but I'm not taking it with me. It's 20 bucks. Um, I'll turn it on for you before you come so you can check it out. And uh, where's my drink? Okay. And I have this television. Um, I didn't watch a lot of TV, so I didn't need any kind of real television. But uh, this, this one, I forget. It's probably at least 20, probably 30 across or diagonal, actually. Probably 35. It's, mm, yeah, around 30. 30. It's big. And uh, it's going to take two guys to carry it down. So if I need to help you, it's 25 bucks to bring it down into your uh, SUV. You're going to need a big trunk maybe with a bungee because uh, this might not fit through uh, like, a, like a passenger door, uh, back seat door. Um, it might, it might not, depending on your vehicle, but um, it's 25 bucks if I got to help somebody bring it down. And if you bring two guys, I'll tell you what, you can have it for free. So just come up here and grab it. It's working. I could show you it works. I'm also selling uh, Sony combo uh, DVD player and VHS player, which I don't know if they're still making them. I think they are. But uh, 25 bucks on this one. I think new they're like 100 or whatever. I don't know, maybe less at this point. But 25 bucks, great working unit. It's yours. Come and get it. And um, oh, I didn't do the lamps. And we have this box for, I lost the, here it is, five bucks. It's like a men's, like a men's jewelry box. It's got a uh, black velvet inside. What is that? Velvet? Yeah, it's velvet. Black velvet. And uh, take this home for five bucks. So, uh, these uh, dragonfly lamps. Here we go. Dragonfly lamps. Let me get some light on the situation. I bought these at Not So Ordinary, beautiful shop on Washington Avenue in uh, North Washington Avenue in Bergenfield. Not So Ordinary. And uh, these came to me like brand new. I don't know, maybe they were in storage or something. Never used, maybe boxed. But uh, uh, these, I have two of them. One's a three-way and this is the single throw, single pull. And uh, I'm just doing these for 30 bucks a piece. So you can take them both for 60 there's no discount on two, these are lovely, unique items, uh, very clean, dust free, and uh, very pretty actually. So it has dragonflies embroidered throughout the shade, and it's got these little, <clears throat> they're, they're black plastic dingle balls, so uh, kind of give it a sexy look, we like sexy around here, so. You met her already, right? We like sexy. And so there's the other one right over there. And uh, that's the three-way. Same lamp, basically. Uh, I think they're, I'm going to let them go as a set, though, only. So 60 for the two. 60 for the two. And we have... Uh, oh. This, I regret, I cannot take with me. I love this mattress. This is uh, an organic mattress. It's natural latex, <coughs> latex rubber, uh, and it's. Um, let me show it to you. It's it's covered in in wool, so it's naturally fire retardant. And with this, I don't know if you see like the sheen on this, but this is a waterproof mattress cover or mattress protector. So I uh, and this is a king size organic organic mattress, by the way, and. Um, don't worry about the size too much because uh, it'll fit through your door, and I'll explain why in a little bit. Um, so it's a it's from Healthy Choice Organic Mattress. Um, I believe it's HealthyChoiceMattress.com, and um, I got it from the Ridgewood, New Jersey store. And the price on this was fifty five hundred. Um, I got this uh, only three, <clears throat> a little less than four years ago, and um, I'm selling it for thirty-five hundred. And I mean, it's pr it's pristine, it's perfect. You can see it's it's super super. The barrier just keeps it that way. It's um, it's like butter. 
I mean, it's it's amazing. It's this feel. I love this mattress. I love sleeping on it. So I suggest if you wanna, if 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 you had any desire to pick up a, one of these mattresses, I know they're expensive, but you can get this one for thirty five hundred. Um, and if I don't have a big rush on it, I, I mean, I like to keep it, um, but. Uh, I, I, I hate that I have to sell it, but uh, I can I can let it go for thirty five hundred, um, and if if it does linger around for a while, we can we can talk maybe um, negotiate a little bit. But I, I I there might be a little bit of room in there. But uh, it, it's a fantastic fantastic mattress, and again I have this in a very clean environment. Um, this uh, no pets, no smoking. And um, this is just this is like this is like butter. Come come here and lay down on this. It's it's just ugh. I I don't know. It's it's it was it's such a comfortable mattress, and I hate that that I can't schlep it all the way over to Los Angeles area. Um, but I have to I, I have to let it go. So some some lucky person. Oh, and by the way, so I have my the door into my apartment's only thirty and a half inches wide. Okay. So how, this is delivered by two men, there's a delivery company that, 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 that's all they do is deliver these mattresses for Healthy Choice Organic Mattress. Um, they have five stores, they're small chains, and these are actually manufactured in the United States, um, in Connecticut, I believe. And um, so, and again, this is a king, it has a split, as, as you can see right there, it has a split uh, box spring. So they go through any door pretty much easily, and it's got a basic steel. Um, it's got a basic steel frame that comes. This all comes together, of course. And um, you're gonna need this frame because you need a center support in the middle here. So right here in the middle, um, this this mattress actually weighs 400 pounds because that's what the latex uh, weighs. And um, this has no pressure points. This is a closed cell, so that means. Uh, the cellular makeup of the latex, uh, I'm sorry, it's an open cell, open cell, not a closed cell. Um, your memory phones are, are closed cell and they're actually hot, they're hot to the touch. And, um, or they, they actually hold your heat. So this, this has a cooling effect. I suggest you come here, I can put down, I'll actually have that barrier down, take your shoes off, come lay on it, see how it feels. This is the, this model's a violet. Uh, that's the name of this particular model. This was the softest uh, version available of, of, of this um, organic mattress. And, um, but it's not that soft. I had a much softer bed through from Sleepy's and um, I had to get used to this a little bit because it's soft but it's not that soft. It's a lot, it's a lot of support and um, it's just a beautiful, it's, it's, a nice, it's a nice sleep. You gotta just check it out. Um, so if you want one at a, at a, you know, good cost, um, almost new, like new, um, it could save you a lot of money, and, uh, I can't schlep it with me, otherwise I would. This guitar could go, I just have to find a little peg in there to, I lost one. So if you can actually handle that, this is an old Epiphone, it's very solid, the newer ones are, you know, definitely not as uh, quality as this one and this one happens to be made in Japan uh, not China Japan there it is Epiphone it's a P model PR 715N PR 715N there's your serial number and Epiphone comes from Michigan uh, and that's it, I guess. And so I'm not taking much with me because I'm going in my new Lexus, um, courtesy of Ray Katina Lexus in White Plains. And uh, I'm going to see if they want to maybe sponsor or co-sponsor some of the trip. And uh, great car, great folks to deal with. Um, I've had some really good car buying experiences at various dealerships over the years, but uh, this one... This this experience was fantastic. Uh, it's a whole different level when you join the Lexus family and um, uh, great bunch of guys over there. My sal salesman Ed Herman, good guy. We had a lot of fun with the purchase, even though we had some disconnects with the finance company that I was using. Everything came through in the end because it was a team effort. Next item up for sale is this white 
uh, it's a one piece butcher block actually this folds in half as you can see it's on hinges right here right um, and then the countertop actually flips over and it becomes one piece so uh, so it could stow away easily it doesn't take up a lot of space in the closet because of the way it folds and if I had another person here I would do that for you uh, it also has some brakes the casters are uh, rubber casters they're, they're solid uh, high quality and uh, you got a nice thick butcher block here also on the right side we have a little holder for a dish towel so that's that's really nice nice feature there and uh, this sells right now on Amazon um, Prime or whatever for uh, 80 bucks so I'm doing 40 on this it's a steal if you're local just come pick it up I'll put it in your trunk and uh, I didn't use it much because I wound up buying this dishwasher so uh, it was a little bit too much for my galley kitchen here so um, I uh, I didn't use it much so it's super clean um, not used at all like barely barely used so it's like it's brand new basically 40 bucks gets it uh, just pull up in front and uh, I'll bring it down and uh, it's a lovely lovely item Oh, and this dresser, uh, I think a friend of mine wanted for his daughter, but he's not rushing over here too quickly to pick it up. So uh, everything here is first come, first serve. And uh, I do have the missing, um, or a replacement anyway. I have the replacement uh, knob. Just have to paint it uh, black. 20 bucks on this. Uh, if my friend shows up, or you show up first, uh, first come, first serve. So, uh, it's got, you know, it's got some wear and tear, it's got some dings from moving around a little bit, and, uh, I don't know, I just had this laying around extra for, just, <laughs> because I don't purge clothes too often, and I should do it more, so, um, it's a nice little unit for boys' room, girls' room, they can paint it, um, it's got a lacquer finish, you can paint it all kinds of colors, and, uh, make it look all cool so uh, 20 bucks here for the Napoleon wall art this is a uh, metal round metal um, frame and it's got this in upstate New York somewhere it's the blue boy by Sir Thomas Gainsborough I believe this is a receiver. Looks like a receiver. Remington receiver. Yes. Uh, we had a Pad Thai restaurant. I played our music. Uh, 20 bucks on that. 20 bucks. Stereo receiver. And, uh, oh, this is a great item. This is selling for, I think, 160 or somewhere around there online, or 150. And uh, it's a, it's a Vita Clay Chef pot which is uh, like a it's a slow cooker but it's in a it's in a clay pot and it's got some uh, accoutrements here some accessories like when this thing's hot you have this this wire hook that'll uh, you can lift the lid with so you can see how everything's cooking inside and then the um, the little spoon here so um, this is made out of Zisha clay which um, uh, has is its properties, the makeup of it, uh, allows for the vitamins and minerals of the foods you are cooking to actually retain within the, the state, to retain within the pot, within the dish itself that you're cooking. So, um, uh, you can make rice in this, you can make soups, I believe there's a yogurt, yes, there's a yogurt mode, you can make, you can make yogurt, soup stews, and different kind of rice, and it has a reheat setting so yeah this is a rice cooker and also um, for slow cooking and you can uh, slow cook uh, your beef bones as well to make bone broth and uh, again I think this this is retailing for something like around 150 or 160 online um, I got this uh, through uh, just association with folks through the, through the magazine 
and um, I had a slow cooker already and, and I just didn't I didn't use this a lot um, so at all really just a handful of times so it's practically new and again this sells for like a hundred fifty forty bucks or 150 60 bucks new online and it's uh, Vita Clay Chef I believe it's Vita if you want to learn about it it's VitaClayChef.com is the website I believe and uh, I do have the manual somewhere you can have that as well um, or actually there's one online in PDF and uh, that should be oh we have this table oh I have some uh, ink cartridge refill kit five bucks uh, hardly used used it a couple times so I just bought it recently so that's five bucks and uh, this table or actually this I don't know if I got this last time 15 bucks on this this has a drawer to hold your files and a couple other drawers so uh, I have my printer on top of it and uh, it's 15 bucks I've had it for a while um, Perfect, perfect piece. Really good. So, um, let's another look at it. 15 bucks on that. Come and get it. And, um, I don't know if I showed this, but this is a, a wooden shoe rack that was actually constructed by my Uncle Kurt, my cosmic Uncle Kurt. And, uh, it is 47 bucks. It's got some water stains on the top because we had plants on it when we had it in our home and unfortunately got a little water damage. But you know, I was th if I would have kept it, I'd like to keep this piece again because it's handcrafted, it's it's handmade um, in Kurt's shop, wood shop, woodworking shop, and uh, it just keeps your your shoes really, really organized. And you know, if you're worried about the water stains, just put magazines on top of it or something like I did. But uh, I was gonna have an, a local upholstery shop build a little frame that would have been the same size as the top of this. And then I would have had them uh, build a cushion on that frame. So, you know, when you're going in and out, you can actually sit on this thing, on the cushion that's built for it and put your shoes on and off. So uh, it's a lovely piece. Um, again, you can cover up the, the water blemishes on the top easily. It's a very lovely piece. Keeps your, your hallway, your foyer very organized. And I used to I keep my bag on it. And uh, Paul, Paul's hanging out with us. And um, again, you can... Uh, it's 40, $47. $47. Uh, again, this is another item I wish I could take with me. But because uh, I might not be able to find something like this again. I have some artists' canvases here, five dollars for five of them. Uh, four are in excellent condition, the other one has a little, uh, got banged up a little. But anyway, it's five for five dollars, a few records. And uh, here's that, uh, here's that futon again. And uh, let me give you some dimensions on that. You look, it's a double size, so it folds out, and I'll show you that in a sec. Um, it is uh, closed, I guess the way it is now. Yes, closed. It's 71 and a half by 36 inches uh, deep and then 33 inches high in this position. 33 inches high and uh, 71 and a half inches across and 36 inches deep let's say and uh, it's a it's a beige micro suede um, it's got it's really nice actually it's got a nice feel to it and uh, I'm blowing it out for a hundred bucks because uh, uh, no it, this is something I would actually take with me just because it's very very practical um, it had a friend dripped a little wax on it and uh, it's not too bad not too noticeable um, and uh, she got some burns on it as well one night so I think she was drinking a little bit too much wine and that's when that occurred and uh, I just steam cleaned this so it uh, I think I mentioned earlier it, it smells nice and uh, I, I used a natural uh, solution that was fruit based 
And uh, so here's how it folds out to a, a full 44 inches wide. It's real, real simple. Bam, there it is. And uh, so you can, you and your friend or lover or wife or whatever can actually sleep on this. Uh, if you're visiting somebody's house or whoever bought this, uh, and you're staying over, you can actually sleep on this. Uh, well, one, one person very, very comfortably. And for two people, you're going to have to love each other a lot, I think, for 44 inches wide. So, uh, but I got that uh, king-size organic mattress. So um, if you're looking to upgrade from this, that's, that's something to look at for sure. So there you have it. Um, lovely. Um, I got these pillows match perfectly. And uh, if you don't buy them, I'm, I'm taking them with me. They're five bucks a piece, and uh, they actually match this, this thing perfectly, as you saw before. So that's the futon.